guys, it is Revan Ninja here and welcome back to Sleepless Night 2, Lady's Nightmare. In the previous video, we have completed the endings to all, Major to all the endings to Majority's Path. So let's move on and let's go meet Natsumi. And also, just saying, I actually recorded this before this. I have to redo it because somehow the audio then picked up from my microphone. And then when I looked at the recording, I was like, wait, what's going on? And then I checked the whole thing. I'm like, what the fuck? What just happened? What caused this to just go on like that without me noticing it? I'm so I'm impressed with myself. Anyway, I'll go with you, Natsumi. The more the merrier. Okay, let's go together. I had great, reac great reactions as well. It's so disappointing. Everything looks normal. Nobody is here. Weird. Say, what do you think of the Suzuka? She's weird. Come on, you have to be. You have to admit, she's weird as fuck. I know, right? We should be careful. I'm pretty sure she has something to hide. Maybe she's even dangerous. You never know. I mean, <laughs> you don't know her secrets. I mean, she's a new girl that just arrived in town a few weeks ago, which is cool and all. But you never want to know what secrets they're hiding from us. You know, you may be. You may be right about that. Of course I am. Anyway, what should we do now? Go back to the others? Maybe it'd be wise to check the other rooms. Oh great. Blackout. Oh god to fuck six. This isn't funny. Yes, it's not funny, Suzuka. I mean come on girl. Jesus. Come on, Suzuka. You can do better, can't you? Can't yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You sure it was her? Dude. It's it's definitely her because First of all, this is her house, and also her aunt Kazumi's house. It says, mm -mm. she knows, she knows what's going on in the place. It's like, come on, dude. Ha! Huh, she's trying to scare us. It's not working. I have a bad feeling about this. It's yeah, I thought so. <laughs> I'll prove to you that there is nothing we should be afraid of. And how would you do this? I'll go to the basement. There has to be a fuse box or something like that. I'll turn on the lights again. The light, yep. Natsumi! I have to follow her. Natsumi? It's so quiet here. My voice seems to be so loud even though I'm whispering. I just realized I have my steam on and people might message me. I hope not, anyway. Why did she run so fast? I can't even hear his footsteps down the stairs. Okay, let's redo this crap again, because I have to redo it! I'm so not impressed! Okay, let's go back to the library. I'm gonna do the same thing I've done earlier. I guess it's better to stay here. She'll be back in no time. I didn't hear that. That was just my imagination. I didn't hear it. It was like, it was like a soft... Really soft. You can't probably hear it, but I, um, yeah. I'll just sit here and wait. It's just a blackout after all. Nothing I should be afraid of. And Sumi's right. Ten minutes later. Dun dun dun. Suzuka's not, sorry, not Suzuka. Then Sumi's not back. <laughs> okay, Suzuka's house is big, but she's been away for a while now. Dots. I should be, I should look for her. Let's go to the kitchen first. Oh shit, blood, am I too late? There's a note. It says, wait, what's this? I'm in a library, please help me, it's me! I didn't say that properly, did I? No, I don't think so. Is this a joke? I was in the library just a few moments ago. Maybe, maybe it's a trap. Yeah, you are right, because we just came from there, so Natsumi can't be there because we have to walk down the stairs and then Natsumi would have to walk up the stairs and be like, oh hey, what took you so long? Like, you know, I'd be like that. Oh, no, I wouldn't yell out in the house, but like, I'm like, what you took you so long? You dirt, what are you doing in the basement? You dirt, you know. It's like, she might have found something really odd in the basement. She's like, oh, I like this. Anyway. <laughs> okay. What the? The windows are cracked. As if something hit it. That's weird. I know, I have no idea what's going on with that. That's that's a bloody handprint. Oh my god, what happened? I hope this blood's not from Natsumi. But then, whose blood could it be? 
Oh yeah, this bit. I don't really know what happened here, but this bit I'm gonna have to save. Alright, the save bit. Um, we could escape through the garden, and this may be my only chance, and this leads to an ending, of course. I'm sorry that's to me, but I have to keep my own safety in mind. I take one last glance at the house. I'm glad the horror is over. Although I managed to escape, I never found peace again. I don't know what happened to the other girls. I'm sorry. Ever since I escaped, I had the feeling as if someone's following me. I wasn't able to sleep at night because of all the nightmares. After a few years, I managed to cope with my fears. But I guess I'll be forever haunted. I also just realized I forgot to put my Skype to do not disturb. I also hope no one messaged me there because I it's possible. It's possible in this one. Let's just hope not. <laughs> Benning for a haunt. You you haunted the rest are known. All right, um, that's this one here. We could we are gonna stay in the kitchen. I'm not stupid. This message was from the Tsumi. You're right. That's right. I was just stay here. Midori, what are you doing here? I thought you were in the library. I was, but wait, where's Natsumi? I kind of lost her. What do you mean you lost her? She wanted to turn on the lights and then she was gone. Poof, bitch. I couldn't even stop her. Oh no, we have to find her. That's the plan. We have to get up here as soon as possible. I agree. We shouldn't split up. Let's stay together. Good. <laughs> you bet. I'll follow you. Is that blood? Yes, it is blood. Yeah, I don't know whose blood it is though. Oh god, I hope it's. I hope not to me as well. I didn't tell her about the note I found. Oh, this bit too. Um. Alright, save. And I'm gonna keep it to myself. We don't even probably freak out. I'll keep it to myself. Because, like. That that message obviously wasn't from Natsumi. She, Natsumi can't be, you know, she can't just drop the note there. I mean, she could, but she would have to walk upstairs to be able to meet me. Because we go down, up and down, we're going to walk past each other, so I'd like, you know, that. So, that's, I know they're best friends, but this situation is not normal. It's just strange. I'll call the police and move myself. Alright, good idea. Give me a sec. Doesn't work. Figures. What was that? They came from upstairs. That's Sumi! Thank god you're here! <laughs> so you were actually in the library? Uh, no. I knew it. Someone else wrote that message. What message? Oh god. Someone's here. I don't think it's following us. It? Natsumi, do you know something? I... I saw something. I went into Suzuka's room and there was this thing. It wasn't human, that's for sure, and it was talking with someone. What did it say? I think it was con controlled by someone. Midori, that's not possible, right? There are no such things. What did the thing say, Natsumi? You have to tell us. It wants to trap us. It wants to kill us. A lock is up forever. Oh, hell no, girl. We ran away now. Let's break one of the windows. Okay, we're gonna save this bit as well, so we're gonna... Alright, that's safe. And let's go to the kitchen door. The, the door in the kitchen seems to be a safe way out. Good thinking. I totally forgot about that. Huh. Right, let's do this. There is the door. Midori really can't wait to leave this place and runs in front of us. Hey. What's the matter? We really should leave. I know. I just want to say thanks. When I was in Suzuki's every fucking time, I always screwed up that word. <laughs> Suzuki's room, I saw this. What is this? A new file. I know it's not a hard saying the name, but it's just... 
I don't even know. It's just me. <laughs> I don't even know why I took it with me. I guess it was just an impulse. Anyway, I don't want it. Please take it. Well, thanks, I guess. Come on, we should go. Finally, we got a nail file, by the way. Just saying, if you haven't... Yeah. I'm glad I was able to save that Sumi Midori. What was this thing that Sumi talked about? Suzuka's still in the house. We don't really know what happened. Maybe she was the one behind all of this. I mean, dude, come on. It's a house. I have repeated this. I don't know if I did or not, but I have said this before. It's a house. She knows what's going on. Somehow, I have a feeling that I missed something. That Sumi's ending. Yes! Awesome. I know, I was so excited when we got this. It was great. Oh my god. You're alive. We are all alive except we don't know what happened to Suzuka. Alright. Um, let's do this. Hurry up. I'll break a window in my shoe on tree. One, two, three. Finally. But what is that? thing that Sumi talked about waited for us. It killed us in a heartbeat. Maybe you should have used another way to escape. Banning the escape. You're dead. We're all dead, but we don't know what happened to Suzuka. If you remember about the note, we're not meant- <laughs> I didn't tell her, I kept it to myself because Mi Midori might freaked out, so I'm gonna tell her this time and see what happens. Midori is not Sumi's best friend, I should tell her. Oh, I forgot to tell you something. What is it? I found a note in the kitchen. A note. What did it say? It was signed by Natsumi and it said she's in the library. What are we waiting for then? Let's go to the library. I thought maybe it's a trap. What? Are you kidding? She could be in danger. And besides, who would have written the note if not her? I'm not sure it's a good idea. Nonsense. I'll rescue her. Midori, please wait. What did I do? I've been waiting for that scream because it's the music to my ears, and especially in this game. You just hear for the scream, just wait and hear for the scream and be like, ah, that's the music. Good music right there. Just, you know, <laughs> I'm not crazy or anything. This is uh, me, Dari! Damn, what's happening here? Oh, this is so swell. Hmm. Okay, this is gonna be a little tricky. It's not gonna be a little tricky. I mean, come on, it's not gonna be a little tricky. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, uh huh. Don't know what I'm talking about now. Um, <laughs> I don't know if these two are the same because I can't tell. Do you want to Okay. Okay, let's go to the library first. Suzuka? Thank god, at least you survived. What do you mean? Suzuka! Midori and Atsumi, they're dead. I found their bodies. Oh my god, what happened? I have no idea, but I know we have to escape. But there is someone in this house, and we don't have time to be sad. I understand. There's a secret passage behind one of the bookshelves. That's so not suspicious. But at least we can get up here. Then let's go. It's so dark in here. Just hold on to my hand. I'll lead us out here. Why do you have a secret passage in your house? Well, my aunt is kind of paranoid. Thank God, I would say. I would never thought I would have to use it one day. But you, you, you think, nah, sorry, nah. Okay, finally. Thanks. We have to call the police and and. I just don't know. It's so awful. I know. I had a weird feeling, but we managed to escape. I will never know what happened in the house. Midori and Atsumi are dead. Why did this happen? Was, this a, was it a coincidence that Suzuka survived? Maybe she... No, I don't have any proof and now I never know the truth. Bad ending. Secret passage. You're alive. Atsumi and Midori are dead. Suzuka is alive. Okay, let's go to Suzuka's bedroom. Shit. Even though I got this scared already, I got really good reaction to this. I still got her. I'm still terrified from this. Intimated by this. 
I'm getting chills down my spine and everything. It's just, it's so creepy. I mean, that smell, come on. That's fucked up, I'd say. It's fucked up. Natsumi! Oh my god, this can be true. Her face, it seems like someone scratched a smiley. It's too horrible, I think I have to draw up. Who put her up there? What? I couldn't even see who entered the room. After one second, I was dead. Maybe it was some kind of sick serial killer, killer that doesn't play a role anymore. I failed to rescue anyone. Bad ending, keep smelling. I'm dead. Sorry, I had to skip that bit. Just escape, escape. Just leave the fucking house. This may be my only chance. I'm sorry, Natsumi, but I have to keep my own safety in mind. Have you done this? I'm glad the horror is over. Although I managed to escape, I never found peace again. I don't know what happens to the other girls and... Ever since I escaped, I had a feeling as if someone was following me. I wasn't able to sleep at night because of all the nightmares. After a few years, I managed to cope my, fe my fears. But I guess I'll be forever haunted. So we got this ending. Well, probably I've got this, I can't remember now. I have a little bad memory, I'd say. Alright guys, let's go to the library. I can't risk it if the Met says really it was from Natsumi, I have to help her. This sounds really, like, it's really dumb, it's obvious that it's not from Natsumi, but it's another ending. It leads to another ending. Trust me. And look, she, she looks stone as fuck. Like, really stone. Natsumi, are you alright? What happened? She's crying tears. Oh, sh why do I, I can't, she's crying blood. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to say she was crying. She was crying bloody tears. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Burning possessed. You're dead. Natsumi's possessed. The rest are unknown. Alright, um, apparently we have got the endings. I hope. And I freaking hope I got the audio from this microphone because I'll be so pissed off, but I'm sure I have it now. It's the reaction wasn't as great as before. I really fucking apologize, guys. So. That's all the endings. It was much shorter than the majority's puff, to be honest. It's so much shorter, and I'm glad short, like, not really, I'm not exactly glad, but it feels really short. I'm not sure if it is to you guys, but, uh, that was it. That was Natsumi's path. We have completed the ending to that, and we shall move on to Suzuka's path the next time. Uh, so, faithfully, if you enjoy, and, um, yeah, do whatever you like. I love you guys.